Here we go into number two. So let's see if we can't get the uh, Gravekeeper's uh, box art this time. And we did. Alright, so there's our Gravekeeper. Spy. Uh, assailant. Um, there's Necro Valley. There's the Oracle, I believe. Uh, Gravekeeper Steel. Um, Shaman. Commander. One of these is Recruiter. And there's the new, one of the new Ultra Rares that a lot of people are looking for. again. Hopefully this time we'll get uh, the uh, other Sylvan card. Not sure how playable the new one is, but uh, hopefully we get it. So there's our Peacekeeper, Jack Frost, and Bougie Intervention. Which is pretty much what I've seen from everyone's. <laughs> so apparently if you get the uh, Sylvan card, it must be really rare and hard to get. Must be a really good card game. Alright, so we got four out of our last one. Let's see if we can get it at about that many this time. Hidden Temples of Necro Valley for our rare. Another Avenger. And the reason I don't go over commons is not only to save on time, but with a nice quality camera, you can, you know, read the names of them, and I go slow enough that you can see all the card and don't have to name everything off. Rare for this one is Ghost Trick Go Around. And the promo card, Sylvan Blade Fender. Bet Frost. Anamanapara uh, as our rare. Got number C92, Hard Earth Chaos Dragon for our rare. From what I've heard, this card works really well with the. Uh, Obedient schooled spell card. And there's our rare, number 39, Utopia Roots. And super rare, Cherubim A, Princess of Autumn Leaves. From what I was saying, I don't think anyone is using the rank, uh, the level 8 build. Got a rare Ghost Trick Dulahan and an ultra rare Bujintai Tsukiyomi. It's a underrated card, it's kind of a draw engine. 
discards your hand have to have at least one draw two not bad especially 2300 defense it's kind of one of those I dare you to attack me type monsters especially when you can turn around and drop crane and honest on top of it We got a rare Sylvan Miko Orange. Another Mario. And an Alpaca. Got a rare Bujin Unity. It's kind of underrated in my opinion, especially when you can return all Beast Warrior Bujins back to the great, back to the deck, and then add up to three with the different names to your hand. And another White Dust on. See, not so short printed as everybody thought it was. And for our last and final pack of Legacy of the Valiant. Hopefully we can end on a hollow, preferably ultimate 101, but if not, again, I can't complain. I got Exiton Knight and Marshall Leaf. Gravekeeper's Heretic as our rare, and the Jack Frost. <coughs> Sorry about that. So here's a quick little recap of everything. So we got two of the Bujian Intervention promos, two Jack Frost, two Peacekeepers, and then from our packs we got Bujian Tai Tsukiyomi, Cherubame Princess of Autumn Leaves, Sylvan Blade Fender, Sylvan Martial Leaf, Gravekeeper Shaman, Skill Prisoner, and Evil Swarm Exiton Knight. Alright, so don't forget, like and subscribe buttons down below. Leave a comment how you think I did on my uh, two deluxe edition box openings. And don't forget to check out uh, my other channel, Hidden Dragon. So this is Anthony from Team Dark Illusions, signing out.